Welcome to Eric Blackman Music. Hi, and welcome to my beginner down picking and alternate picking tutorial for guitar. This will work on electric as well as acoustic guitars. The guitar is in standard tuning E, A, D, G, B, E. I'm going to try to teach you how to do this without talking you to death. We will start with down picking which is playing a string and just going down like that. Then I'll try to show you an easy way to learn how to alternate pick. Alternate picking is down, up, like that, and moving from string to string, like this. For this lesson, I'd like for you to use a thin pick. For beginners, a thin pick is going to be a lot more forgiving. Now when you get this technique down, you can use any pick that you would like. Now the first thing we need to do is to learn a scale that we can use to practice with. Now I've chosen the natural scale because it's easy and it's in the first position of the guitar. Now if you want to learn this scale ahead of time, you can go to my tutorial on YouTube called How to Play and Understand the Natural Scale. Use the link in the description below this video to get you there. Now the natural scale is simply the natural notes in the first position, which are E, F, G, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C, D, E, F, and G. For the first half of our lesson, we'll play through that scale and we'll down pick. Here's how we're going to do it. For down picking, we're going to take our pick and hold it like this. Just like that. I've got it resting on my index finger and I'm going to take my thumb and put it across there like that and have the point pointing toward the strings. I'm holding it very gently and I'm going to take my pick, lay it on the top E string, okay, and we're going to just gently press down. We don't want to pick it hard like that to get a lot of buzz and rattle. We want to pick it very gently. Now when I pick this string, I want to land on the string under it. This eliminates pick travel. Okay, We don't want the pick all over the place and we don't want to pick out like this, away from the string. We're going to lose control when we do that. What we want to do is gain very good control of the pick. We're going to take our pick, place it on the low E string, at an angle like that, press down gently and land on the string under it. Let's move to the next string and do the same thing. Next, next, and so on. like that. Even when you're strumming chords, you want to practice this technique. See how that pick is just gliding over those strings?
Now let me show you the scale we're going to use. We'll practice our picking technique using this scale. Here we go. Open. First. Third. Move to the next string. Open. Second. Third. Move to the next string. Open. Second. Third. The next string. Open. Two. The next string. Open. One. Three. And the high E string. Open. One. Three. This will teach us to hear something as we're picking so we can tell whether we're getting something accomplished or not. And here's what it sounds like. Now you need to practice down picking like that until it's not a problem for you. Then you want to move on to alternate picking. We're going to alternate pick this scale this way, starting with a down pick, now the hardest part of alternate picking is to know when to go down and when to go up with your pick. This lesson is going to eliminate that problem because we're going to make some decisions about how we're going to do it before we even try it. First of all, let's go to the low E string and we're going to pick down, up, down. Now let's not let the pick travel very far. When we go down, we're going to land on the string under it. When we come up, we're going to make a short strum up and then we're going to go down again. Now we want to practice that for a while, like this. Down, up, down. Down, up, down. So when you play the open string, you're going down every time. That's when you alternate, because you're going down, up, down, and then you've got to reset and go down again. Down, up, down. There's your alternation. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to play our scale, and we're going to do that for every string. For the low E string, we're going to go down, up, down. When we go to the next string, we're going to go down, up, down. So every time we go to an open string, we're going to be picking downward. For the D string, we're going to go down, up, down. For the G string, down, up, because we only have two notes to play. Then we're going to go to the B string, down, up, down. And then to the high E string, down, up, down. So let's do that again. Low E string, down, up, down. A string, down, up, down. D string, down, up, down. G string, down, up. B string, down, up, down. High E string, down, up, down. So here it is. Remember, every time we go to a new string, we're going to start with a down pick. Here we go.
I promise you, if you spend some time practicing this technique, eventually you will be able to down pick and alternate pick about as well as any average player out there. Thanks for stopping by and have a great day.